Hi there. If you are watching this video, you have chosen to invest in yourself and make a commitment to yourself and your recovery and healing by joining Transforming Pain to Power, the Narcissistic Recovery Program. And this video is my heartfelt welcome to you. I've been thinking today what a blessing it is and how grateful I am to be able to offer not just this program, but just to offer the many years of experience and wisdom and stories and just this richness that's come out of my work with people. And so, yes, you're going to be, you know, on the receiving end a lot of a lot of research and creativity and ideas and the things that worked for me in my own recovery. Um, but more importantly, it is the outcome of knowing what works for people and what doesn't work for people. And um, also, perhaps, a new understanding about narcissism that's more empowering. If you come into this process from a victim archetype or feeling like a victim or looking for that validation, you're staying in the same low vibrational state that, that kept you in the abuse, if I can use that word or that way. But my plan here and my big vision and mission is to help people like you Stand in your power, celebrate your gifts, feel good, be confident, know your unique soul esteem so you can go out into that big wide world connected to your heart and doing the work that you are meant to do. I heard Carolyn May say today that um, one of the best things that we can do as human beings is empower one another. And I thought, wow, what a, an incredibly soul aligned message, right? Because that's what I'm trying to do here. For so many of us, we've had our power taken away. We've had, you know, people who, who feed their energy by taking our energy away. So my goal here is to give that back to you. And if, if we do have a chance to all gather together, you know, be that virtually or at a retreat, um, or in my space here in Peterborough, that, that we do that for one another. So the program is going to be delivered in uh, six, but possibly seven modules. You can go through them if you like. I recommend you take your time. Um, carve out space for this. Make that space beautiful. Right. I know every single one of you has a gift in that area of making a space more in, inviting and warm and uh, appealing to the eye than it was before. So do that for yourself. Have a beautiful journal. Have your favorite drink. Light a candle. Noticing what you smell and taste and hear. So have some beautiful music. Right. Engage all of your senses to do this work. And that is my heartfelt welcome to you. And you will hear that message again as we get together to do our individual debriefings. And I send you big love and compassion. And man, I can't wait to have this conversation with you on the other side.